The new sperm highlighter kit sensitively and specifically labels human sperm heads with a fluorescently tagged antibody. The kit is easy to use and the simple and direct labeling procedure will be presented in this video. We will demonstrate the steps needed to extract biological material from a swab, apply the extract to a slide, and fluorescently label human sperm heads with the sperm highlighter kit. Here we show the preparation of an extract from a swab. First, the swab head is cut into an extraction tube and PBS is added. The extraction tube is vortexed and incubated at room temperature for one hour. Next, a portion of the extract is applied to the sample window of a sperm highlighter slide and air dried. Please note that other laboratory SOPs for evidence handling are also compatible with sperm highlighter staining. Once the extract is dried, two drops of fixative are added to the sample window from the white capped bottle and the slide is incubated at room temperature for 10 minutes. This adheres the sample onto the slide. After the fixation step is complete, the fixative is rinsed from the sample window using the provided sperm highlighter wash solution. Vigorous washing is neither required nor recommended. Wash solution is provided as a 10x stock that must be diluted with water prior to use. Sample preparation solution plus DTT must be freshly prepared. For each sample to be stained, Two drops of sample preparation solution from the yellow capped bottle are combined with one microliter of freshly thawed one molar DTT. The solution is mixed thoroughly and is immediately ready for use. After the fixative is washed off, User-prepared sample preparation solution plus DTT is pipetted onto the sample window and the slide is incubated at room temperature for 30 minutes. This step conditions the sample for staining. After the sample preparation step is complete, the slide is once again rinsed with diluted sperm highlighter wash solution. Next, two drops of blocking buffer are added to the sample window from the bottle with the red cap. The slide is incubated at room temperature for 30 minutes to eliminate nonspecific antibody interactions. When the blocking step is complete, the washing step is repeated. Next, two drops of antibody solution are added to the sample window from the green capped bottle and the slide is incubated at room temperature for 30 minutes. This fluorescently labels any human sperm heads that are present on the slide. After the antibody labeling step is complete, a final wash is performed. At this point, the staining is complete and slide visualization is possible. However, Mounting the slides with the provided mounting media improves the visualization quality and is therefore recommended. To mount the slides, one drop of mounting media is added to the sample window from the blue capped bottle. Next, a cover slip is placed on top of the window and gently pressed down.
Sperm highlighter stain slides must be visualized with a fluorescence microscope fitted with the appropriate filter cubes. All cell nuclei are labeled fluorescent blue, and all human sperm heads are labeled fluorescent green. The intense fluorescent sperm head label enables rapid slide screening at low magnifications and reveals sperm that would have otherwise been obscured by debris or other cells. <laughs>